Hi, and welcome to Premier Radiology, a physician-owned outpatient imaging center offering state-of-the-art imaging equipment managed by highly experienced technologists and board-certified fellowship-trained subspecialty radiologists. You're here today for a myelogram. A myelogram is an x-ray examination of the spine involving the injection of a contrast material to outline the spinal canal and nerves. It is commonly performed to evaluate back pain, radiculopathy, spinal stenosis, and disc herniation. Prior to the myelogram, you will change into a gown. You will then be taken into the myelographic suite. After you lay down on the examination table, the physician will use an x-ray camera to determine the best location for the spinal injection. Your skin will be cleaned with betadine, an orange iodine-based soap which will feel cold against your skin. A sterile drape will be placed and you will be given some numbing medicine called lidocaine. The numbing medicine will cause a slight stinging and burning sensation as it is injected into the tissues. During the contrast material or dye injection, you may experience cramping of your hips, heaviness of your legs, pressure or ringing in your head or ears, or you may even experience heightened pain. After the contrast is completely injected, we will remove the needle and a bandage will be applied. We will then take your myelographic x-ray images and you will be sent for your CT scan. Keep in mind that any time a needle is placed through the skin, there are potential risks or complications, the most serious of which are bleeding and infection. There is also the rare risk of nerve injury or spinal cord injury. After the myelogram, you should drink plenty of clear liquids and remain in bed with your head slightly elevated for the next eight hours. You should resume a regular diet and your usual medications. Avoid alcohol consumption for 24 hours and do not engage in strenuous work, exercise, physical therapy, or lifting for 48 hours. You should not drive for the remainder of the day after the procedure. This ends the review of a myelogram. Before the procedure begins, a physician will speak with you and answer any questions you may have.